No, come on. What do you mean? Huh? I said no. Come on. You're not gonna go. Huh? Brown, I don't think you understand what I'm saying. No, I'm being so. Would you like to see where my water broke it? I don't know, it was just a lot of liquid came out of my tukey. So what's happening? Nothing right now, thank God. But we finna unpack this bag. And I'm about to take a shower. She gonna take a shower. Oh, you took a shower last night, didn't you? Mm -hmm. Yeah, you did. Then um, straighten up in here. You need to call your doctor. Yeah. You know, we can wait a couple hours if you want to. Or you can go ahead and call them. Yeah, I'm gonna call him. Yeah, call him. See. You know what I'm saying? Okay. I'm gonna call him, okay? Okay. Okay. I got your daddy. I was like, well, I'm gonna fly to the book. He said, what do you need to do? Oh. Did you do rush <laughs> Oh, with the flow. Yeah. Literally. <laughs> this is ridiculous. Okay, guys. I told you guys sometimes you just gotta roll with the punches that are given to you. So it's what time? 9-16, August 11th. So my water was supposed to break. 9-11. Whoa! 8-11. We can do this. It's okay. You know, it's fine. God's timing is always the right timing. If he allows something to happen, I'm okay. I trust him. First, it was scary because the first thing I said was, no, it's not time. I was like, please just be peeing on yourself, please. But it wasn't pee at all. My hospital bag's not packed. I should probably get to packing that now. Yeah, I'm going to go ahead and start packing that. Because I, um, it's not packed at all. Not ready to have some stuff in there. Okay, goodbye. I think you're crazy. Hi, guys. Okay. Oh. This is crazy. Can you focus, please? Okay. I didn't, I, I wasn't even supposed to have this hairstyle for giving birth. I was supposed to have something totally different. Forget it. Because it's fine. I'm fine. Got me all hooked up so they can get the baby's heart rate. Um, 
I'm contracting, but they're not bad, thank God. I mean, it's only been an hour. Hi. Chicken noodles and soup. <laughs> <laughs> Stop making me laugh. Not bad. Yeah, he's here. Mommies can't come. My initial plan before this whole corona thing started was to be him, his mommy, me, my mommy, and my sister. Is that too much to ask for? But now we have to do Zoom. Yeah, it's fine. We work with what we got. And I am 35 weeks pregnant. I was definitely expecting to be, I was praying to be like 37 weeks plus. Then I would have felt like I was in control. But I've been shown that I am not in control. So now I just have to go with the flow with whatever the doctor recommends or with whatever, you know, is best for the babies and myself, but really the babies. So, yep, I had to change my whole mindset. When my water broke, my first thought was, no, it's not time and I can't think like that because if it's happening, that means it is time. So, just had to control my thoughts. My mama here? definitely was like, it is time. If it's happening, it is time. I so, I'm okay. First. I'm all right. Hey, guys, now the phone, huh? I can call you back. I'm having contraction as we speak. Well, it's starting. Alright. Alright. Hmm. Hmm. This is Raven. Say hey to Raven. Hmm. Say hey to Raven. Hmm. Hmm. I'm hungry, but oh, that word is very cool. Mm -hmm. So that word is spreading. Really? Oh my God. What you want from me, man? You get on my nerves. I'm sorry, what you want? Oh, uh, no. Don't you a surprise? I'm not, I don't want to... Spoil the surprise? No, I don't want to speak any... Okay, goodbye. I'm going to talk to him for a second. Yo. And we're recording. We're recording? We have two babies. Is it recording right now? Yeah. Oh, I'll come over here. Excuse the nipple. This is the baby. I don't think he really wants it. He's just sitting there. Ooh, opening his eyes. Oh, big old black eye, boy. Yes, sir. <laughs> I don't want it. He don't. Hey, Lana. I'm moving hurts. I'm trying to get him up. You gotta do your hey guys. You know what I'm saying? It's going on YouTube, baby. I know. I'm trying to. Hey guys! You know, Alana here. You know, I just gave birth and, you know, I just, you know. I can't move him. Okay, hold on. You wanna hold this? Just put it down. Alright, sorry guys, hold on. Can I just press the button? Hey, hey, hey. Hey, hey, hey. Hey, pick up my child. Hey, hey. Come here. We have to talk to them. We haven't talked to them in like three days. We didn't have kids. Bro, why do I keep making it like no? Why do I keep making it seem like we've had them for like I don't know a week or something? It really feels like it's been that long. Come here. We're cool. having these chickens? Yeah. Come here. Sitting on my body. I miss them. I want them. So we gotta give you guys an update. Hi guys. Um, I actually just changed out of the hospital clothes I was in for like two days. I look a little dead inside, but it's okay. She think I'm gonna sit on this bed with her, but no, little do y'all know, it's blood and goulash all over the covers. <laughs> Goulash, ew, my face looks swollen. Oh my gosh, ignore it. But I, yeah, I just changed out of hospital clothes and just put on this robe. Just finished pumping as well. And you guys are probably wondering, where are the babies? They're in the NICU. Cause they decided to come five weeks early and they're twins and one was breached. And yeah, I will be telling y'all the um birth story soon, but I think this is the end of the... She threw away my apple juice. I didn't mean to. 
Little do y'all know, and it's kind of hard to get apple juice where we at. They had, you know what I'm saying? They said they ran out, but I gave a lot of my apple juice to go sit it down. I'm sorry. She went, threw it away. So I didn't mean to. I don't have no apple juice, but she got a cranberry juice, though. I cut though. my nails, but I got my juice, huh? Yep. <laughs> no apple juice for me. Oh, I haven't brushed my teeth. I'm just all in your face. I'm sorry. Yep, you is. Oh my God, my neck looks weird, too. Do I look weird? No, dude, you look the same. Do I look a little dead, though? No. Like, I just... You look light. You look lighter. No, I look a little dead. You look lighter. I look a little dead. I don't know. But pale, not like, a, you know, like, I don't know. Mm. What? You just be talking. Is something wrong? No. You're scaring me. You just be talking. I'm looking at you like... I didn't brush my teeth. Oh my god. <laughs> oh, look at that booty. Dang it, we missed it. Oh, chill out. <laughs> this is the pumping thing because I've been pumping today. Today's the first day I started pumping. It was actually, it's pretty doing, doing, doing. It's going pretty good, actually. Let me sit you guys right here. Hopefully, you guys don't fall. And if you fall, just run, send help. But yeah. We go home tomorrow at like five or six. The babies are not coming with us, obviously. Um, yeah, they're not coming with us. I'm gonna let you guys see them. Oh, what time is it, boo? Five o'clock on the dot. It's five o'clock in the morning. We've lost it's our five sense of time. In the morning. Conversation you remember that song? Oh my god, shut up. No, it's 5.14. Okay. So, yeah, we lost our sense of time being in here. I mean, we don't go to... We go to sleep usually around this time anyway. But, like, we haven't been... We weren't sleeping. Yesterday, we didn't sleep at all. Like, we hadn't slept in a good 48 hours yesterday. But today, when they took um, Davion out of here, when they took the baby out of here... Because we had the boy all day, as y'all saw in the clip before this. We had him all day. It was just Dior where she had, um, she was breached. So they didn't, they wanted to make sure all the fluid was out of her lungs and stuff. So they had her in the NICU that whole day. But Davion was with us the whole day. I didn't get any clips because I just wanted to really enjoy the time I had with him. And I was kind of woozy, kind of out of it. Kind of like just recovering, you know, from the whole process. So, yeah. But now, um, Davion's sugar started dropping, so they took him down to the NICU, make sure he's stabilized and make sure he can stabilize himself for a good week and then a week or two, maybe. I really pray to God that they tell me that he can come, that they can come home in like four days, four or five days. But at the same time, when it's twins and they come early like this, you want to make sure that they are perfectly fine so you don't have to rush home from the hospital with a baby that is in like a bad condition because that's really scary as well and I do not want to go through that this camera is about to die and I don't have a charger and I need to film tomorrow so I'm gonna try to save some batteries oh shoot almost dropped it. all right bye see you tomorrow okay hopefully y'all can hear me I'm here to go see them in the NICU I was discharged yesterday but I'm here to go see them today, so. I miss my babies. I love them so much. Yeah. It's so sad. It's the hospital. I can't really show y'all, but, you know. I'll show you the babies when we go up. Mommy's on FaceTime. Let's look at the babies. This is Davion. Hi, my baby. Hello, my baby. We got Nikki, baby. You babies. got the door. You ready, okay? And they're, they're going to come pick you up. Okay. Dior. Got Nikki, baby. We'll be home soon.